What's going on YouTube? Geosnow right here. So in today's video we have some important news to discuss about the Electra, about the component that has been released by MeanSpark Zinc and of course about 11.3.1. So just a couple hours ago MeanSpark Zinc has released a very important component that will help the Electra to be updated for the iOS 11.3.1 and older. As you can see he says quote our new research iOS 11.3.1 jailbreak internals remount root SS or root file system and he posts an article. By the way we will have two talks about Apple security at DevCon. Welcome to follow us. So he pretty much released this article in here with anything required in order to pretty much fix the problem introduced by Apple in I think iOS 11.3 where of course they, um, they pretty much mitigated a remount Thing that we used in jailbreaks and now they found a fix means Zing has found a fix that he used in his jailbreak demo a couple weeks ago and he released that that can of course be used by Coolstar in order to update the Electra because this was one of the missing pieces that we now have so yes means Zing did release something very important for the iOS 11.3.1 jailbreak in fact one of the developers of the Electra confirmed this on Twitter quote this is what we needed for the Electra. However, it seems that changes to the root file system are discarded after reboot, as it's now a mounted APFS snapshot. Anyways, this is very important because this means that they can use this on iOS 11.3.1, 11.3, 11.2.1 and so on in order to make everything to work with the Electra. So expect an Electra update very soon in the future. And it's definitely confirmed by now, Electra will be updated to work with iOS 11.3.1 1.3.1 and lower. For those of you who are asking me whether it's going to support iOS 11.2.6.2.5.2.2.2 and so on, yes it will. So if you're running any of these firmware in here you will be safe. I recommend you to update to 11.3.1 right now after this video if you're running iOS 11.3, 11.2.6, 11.2.5 and so on. I definitely recommend you to go to iOS 11.3.1 because it's safe and it's a newer version so you will have more future proofing for your device if you're running an iOS 11.3.1 than iOS 11.2 for example. It has less bugs that were present in here. So I definitely recommend you that if you're not already jailbroken. If you are jailbroken for example on iOS 11.1, 11.1, 11.1.2 11 and so on then do not update to 11.3.1 unless you really want to use the next jailbreak. Uh, you can actually save the blobs for the iOS 11.3.1, very important. If you don't know how to do that, I'm gonna make a video. Just tell me in the comment section down below. Save the blobs because the iOS 11.4 SEP and Baseband are compatible with the 11.3.1. So even if it gets unsigned, if you are jailbroken on a lower version like iOS 11.1.2, you will still be able to upgrade at any time because the iOS 11.4 SCP and Basement are compatible. The only condition is to save your blobs, so do it right now. For anybody else, if you're running iOS 10 for example, I definitely recommend you to do whatever you feel like. iOS 10 has a little bit more speed, but at the same time there might be tweaks in the future that would work only on iOS 11. So if you feel like trading off a little bit of the speed and updating to iOS 11, of course 11.3.1, don't update to 11.4, iOS 11.4 will not benefit of this jailbreak right now. But if you want to update, you can do so. The iOS 11.3.1 jailbreak will definitely come, so you won't lose anything but a little bit of the speed, because iOS 10 is a tiny bit faster on some devices. Anyways, it's all up to you. But if you're running any of these firmware in here, iOS 11.2 up to iOS 11.3.1, I would stay on iOS 11.3.1 because it's newer and of course it means less bugs compared to these in here and of course this means that you will have a little bit more future proofing. But anyways, yes, a very important component for the jailbreak has been already released and I think that Coolstar is already doing stuff in the background with this. So yes, it's definitely coming and it's definitely good. Huge thanks to Minspark Zeng for releasing his method. I thought he will keep it secret. No, he didn't. He actually released it and we can use Use this in the jailbreak. This of course saved a lot of time from Coolstar because otherwise he would have had to figure this out by himself. So it's definitely good. We're going to see Electra 
updated in the future. I will keep you updated with anything that's going on in the jailbreak community. If you're planning to upgrade to 11.3.1, do it right now. iOS 11.4 is already out and I think iOS 11.3.1 will not stay signed for so long. So definitely do it right now. Thank you for watching guys, I'm Geosnow, until the next time, peace out.